as I look as I look through this, the only change was referencing the fifty dollar transient vendor fee for an annual period. Okay. Um, so that fifty dollars is not per week. It's not per appearance. It's for an annual period. Okay. The other thing is a BCI background check, which is six dollars. I know Mr. Weisberger has gone through extensive background checks for his profession. I know I have gone through them before mine. Um, I'll be honest with you. My family and my kids come down here all the time. I want to know that the people either down here, whether whenever they are, or coming through our neighborhoods, have been vetted. That's only, I think, prudent in all of our best interests, in all of the 12,000 residents of Lovell. Okay? And, I mean, I, and the $50, I purchased a property in St. Bernard for my boys to live in because they're going to school. The city of St. Bernard sent me a thing and said, you have to register as a landlord, and oh, by the way, the fee is $50. I also have to subject the property to an inspection, and that fee is that fee and inspection is done annually. Now, I could be upset by that, or I could say that's a protection of my investment. If that village is assessing ownership and the properties themselves, that protects my investment down there. So I guess it's a matter of perspective on are we, is this punitive, or are we truly protecting all of us? <coughs>